Welcome to Make It Monday. I'm Sarah King, and today I'm gonna to show you how to make a spread using a combination of magazine pieces and tissue paper. Tissue paper has become pivotal for me whenever I'm making anything that looks like mixed media or collage. It adds a really nice element of layering, and because it's semi-transparent, it still allows room for you to read the words. Now this page I already did a demo for and it will be used in my Vision Journaling 101 course that is coming out soon, so stay tuned for that. Meanwhile, I'm gonna make a complimentary page using the same tissue paper, but more, uh, more directed at these two pieces. A little bit more focused page. This one had a lot of different verbs on here. This one is the cover page for my do section. This one I want to focus in here on ready to make an impact. To do this, you're going to need a little bit of Mod Podge or liquid white glue. Put it in a cup, a little bit. Next, I'm going to add a little bit of water and use a foam brush. Water, mix up your mixture. You're gonna have diluted Mod Podge or white, kind of like Elmer's glue, would work fine for this glue. Mix it up. Okay, I have these here just to kind of get them lined up for later, but I'm actually going to do the background first. You always want to have a little light layer of the liquid underneath and what that allows you to do is um, kind of have a base to work with. I'm going to start with dark on the edges and do sort of an ombre looking effect this time. all done now you leave it to dry when it's dry carefully remove this piece of parchment paper and then you can trim around the edges just like this one to make it nice and smooth then as a last step you can cover it with Mod Podge um, without diluting it this time use your foam brush and do a really light coat over the whole thing and it'll protect it really nicely